to wrap up, I'll now be showing all the great stuff that I got at Universal and Disney World. For some reason, I got more stuff, I think, at Universal than I did Disney World, but I think that's because the Universal parks were easier to get through in one day, and Disney World, we just didn't have much time to, to go in through all the shops. So, um, from Cat in the Hat, I've got a Thing 1, Thing 2, it's actually a short sleeve jacket, which is kind of weird, um, but kind of cool since I get cold very easily. A just general Universal shirt featuring some of its most popular rides, Terminator, E.T., Jaws, Twister, Mummy, Men in Black, and Disaster. Had to have an E.T. shirt, which on the back says, If Lost, Phone Home. It's kind of the thing that clinched it for me. One of my favorite movies of all time, Twister. The show they put on was pretty cool too. But on the back, again, just awesome. Look out for the cow. If anyone remembers the multiple cows that were spinning around in the Twister. Um, another thing from the Cat in the Hat area. Uh, say hello to my little friends with Cat in the Hat and Thing 1 and Thing 2. Just thought this was really cool. The Grinch. I'm a huge Dr. Seuss fan. Also a huge Harry Potter fan. So this is the the Thestrals. You can only see the, the horses that carry the carriages, but you can only see them if you're if you've seen someone die. And it's got the, the Luna quote on them about uh, uh, Harry Potter not being crazy that he's just the same as she is. It's really cool. A hippogriff. Again, from Harry Potter. And, of course, Gryffindor. So, now I think that's everything from Universal. So, going on to the stuff at Disney World. Um, this is one of my favorite characters from the Muppets, Beaker. A lot of people don't remember Beaker from Bunsen and Beaker. But, um, yeah, I really like the little scientist. This was a really fun ride that we went on with... Um, Figment, the, that's the name of the dragon. He is the figment of your imagination, which I thought was clever. And uh, it was a cute little ride, and just I thought the dragon was really cool. Oh, whoops, this is also from uh, Universal. Uh, from the Shrek 3D movie. Of course, the sad eyes, puss in boots. And then it says the bottom, uh, whatever happens, I must not cry. So, back to Disney World. A Winnie the Pooh hoodie with uh, him saying, Tigger, is that you? Just thought that was pretty cool. It's from Animal Kingdom. And this is probably my favorite thing of all, which is kind of hard to see. But it's a uh, villain's jacket. So it's got all the villains in black and white. This is my Mickey Mouse book bag. If you spent over $40 in the store, you got the $60 book bag for, I think, $16. Um, so, yeah, it's pretty easy to spend $40 in the store considering how high the, the shirts and stuff are marked up. Um, so, yeah, I got my own Disney book bag, which came in great at Orlando Studios because the book bag that I usually have has a lot of side pockets, which don't fit very well into their lockers, so we end up utilizing this one a lot. Um, my... Tigger coffee mug. Um, I don't drink coffee, really, um, or tea, actually. But, um, yeah, I just thought he was really cool with his little spiraled-out eyes. And uh, this is wired for another day, but I'll definitely get a lot of use out of this. And this is probably the, the one thing that it's just kind of a souvenir that I don't actually have a purpose for. And it is my very own Harry Potter wand. Uh, this is actually Victor Crumb's wand, but I really liked it because it had the... Um, Hippogriff on the handle, and uh, yeah, just really, really awesome. And uh, yeah, the other ones are pretty cool too. You could actually you could get Harry Potter's wand, Dumbledore's, and then they had um, about a dozen other just random ones that you could choose from. But uh, I really like the the hippogriff. At the Harry Potter park, we definitely had to try the pumpkin juice and the butter beer. Both of the pumpkin juice is actually, uh, it was amazing. It tasted like pumpkin pie in liquid form. And the butter beer was actually really good too. It was some sort of caramel, frothy, just deliciousness. And um, 
uh, we got a few of the press pennies, which are just really cool cheap uh, souvenirs. Let's see. There's Rafiki. Uh, the spitting dinosaur from Jurassic Park. And this is a cool one I've never I've never seen before. You can also get pressed quarters. So this has got Pumbaa and Timon and Simba from Lion King. Cool thing about the two drink sewers, you got to keep the uh, commemorative uh, containers they came in. This one isn't really Disney themed, but I picked one of these up for me and one of these up for the person that took care of my cats while I was away. Um, it's a really cool handmade uh, Mexican cat. Uh, picked it up at the uh, Mexican area at Epcot, and uh, it's just really cool in the Aztec section. It's, uh, yeah, hand-painted, hand-carved. It's just really cool, and a little something other than Disney. Um, I did forget one article of clothing. Got a couple of uh, Nemo tank tops that have the seagulls on them going mine. Um, it was in a two-pack, so this is. Uh, I also have one in purple. Uh, but that one is in the laundry, but yeah, I love the Nemo. Actually, I just love Nemo. It's one of my favorite movies. Um, from Universal, uh, Popeye uh, Tao. Yeah, Popeye is one of my all-time favorite characters as well. So it's got Popeye and Olive and the hamburger guy, and then it has uh, some quote about Toon Lagoon down there. My Nemo hat, which I completely forgot to bring a hat to Disney World. Um, hey, beside him. In the sun down there, that is a bad idea. So pick this up at Animal Kingdom on the first day. And it's even got the shark fin, which was really helpful for uh, my folks being able to find me in crowds. Because I tended to walk a little faster than them. And uh, with all the crowds there, yeah, this is great for pointing me out. And uh, I got lots of comments on it too. So, especially when I went to Universal, um, the Jaws ride, the Jaws mechanical shark was named Bruce, as well as the Bruce in here. So, that's kind of cool. Hey, buddy. Um, so, here is the last of it Tigger and Pooh, like fleece blanket. It's really nice on the car ride home. They've got these pin trading stations now set up all over Lion King or <laughs> all over Disney World. So, I picked up a couple from my favorite movies. Uh, the Lion King, which they really didn't have too much Lion King stuff. I was kind of saddened about that. Um, but I was able to find a pin. And then from Alice in Wonderland, the Cheshire Cat. I think he's really cool. And then I did pick up a few little odds and ends. This is actually a surprise for my dad. He collects ducks. So this is the Pirates of the Caribbean uh, Donald Duck. Duck. <laughs> Um, my favorite turtle from Nemo, Little Squirt. Again, the uh, Figment Dragon. One of my favorite characters of all time, Tigger, in his little Animal Kingdom safari set. This guy's actually a keychain. And the Cowardly Lion from The Wizard of Oz. What sold me on this one was he even had, has his little badge of courage. So thought it was really, really cool. And uh, the little stuffed animals were actually pretty reasonably priced for being amusement parks, so uh, so I picked those up. Um, but yeah, that's, I think, everything that I picked up. Probably went a little overboard, but uh, I probably won't get back to Disney World Orlando area for another 10 or 15 years. So I figured it was a good time to splurge while I had the chance. So hope you enjoy this.